Welcome to the lettuce hem tutorial where we will be making a lettuce hem both with a sewing machine and a serger. I'll start with my sewing machine and head over to my zigzag. I will then go ahead and adjust my length to really, really short, almost bar tack short to get the stitches close together. Next, I will adjust my width. I'll set it to somewhere between two and three. This is completely up to you and your liking. I recommend trying this out on a piece of scrap fabric first. I'm gonna put my fabric under my presser foot, centered, stretch as I'm sewing and try to keep this pressure even. I'm holding my fabric on the left, which means I let the needle go mostly on top of the fabric. I let my needle fall just over the raw edge on the right side. And here's the result of a 2.5 wide zigzag from my sewing machine. My serger, there are four things that I need to do. The first one is to remove the left needle. We're only going to need the right one. The right needle is closest to the stitch plate and the cutting blade adjust my this is my width the seam width a little pokey thing i don't know if you can see it it's all the way in there it's like a hand a seam width hand i need to disengage it so i get this really narrow hem and i'll adjust the stitch length to f which is fine it means it has really uh stitches are coming very tightly together and then I'll adjust my differential feed, which usually sits on one, which set it up to 0 0.7, but you can set it anywhere in between, depending on how curly you want your hem. Um, and it just means that it feeds more.